Crabtree is just unlucky in love, I think. I don't think it's because of anything that he does or doesn't do. Because really, he's quite charming. <laughs> Miss Montgomery. Mr. Crabtree, could I have a word? I was hoping I would see you again. I really want to apologize. As do I. No, no, no. I, I never should have been so aggressive in my critique. And I should not have asked for a critique if I'm prepared to hear it. Once I call myself, I realize how greatly I could benefit from your comments on my novel. Oh, Crabtree, just be yourself. <laughs> Relax. Crabtree's probably unlucky in love because it just hasn't been the right person, hasn't been the right time. He's so earnest, he's so forthcoming that sometimes when you want it so bad, you end up tripping over yourself. George? Yes? Please come closer. I think Lucy sees in Crabtree and he's really creative, really determined, really imaginative, really able to express himself, but maybe not as <laughs> eloquently as he thinks he can. They fall for each other a little bit, and they're both sort of romantics at heart and with great imaginations. And Crabtree really falls for her, right? He says something to Higgins about, you know, like, this girl could be, could be the one. Lucy was a really fun potential love interest for Crabtree because she's smart, she's witty, and the main character that she's famous for, Anne of Green Gables, was in many ways very similar to the Crabtree that we know and love. So that made for a very fun dynamic between the two of them. Crabtree is a bit unsure of himself, certainly, and, and with, with some women. Uh, maybe he's a bit intimidated, certainly with Dr. Grace. You know, she was sort of a of higher social standing than he was. With Edna, when her husband came back, you know, Crabtree wasn't sort of like, oh, I'll fight for my woman. He thought, okay, that's a family. You know, he sort of bowed out, you know, he said, I have to let that happen. I mean, he, sometimes he doesn't handle himself wonderfully with women. But, you know, what attracts women to Crabtree? Well, I think his looks, he's just such a good looking guy. <laughs> and George? Yes? I don't leave until the morning. <laughs> 